Frontline workers at a major Minnesota health care system are prepared to go on strike. The majority of Alina Health's unionized health care workers voted last week to support a strike if they can't reach a deal with management in their latest contract. As Kate Radis reports, the employees say they feel disrespected after working on the front lines during the pandemic. Alina Health has been in contract negotiations with health care workers who are members of SCIU Healthcare Minnesota since January. The union says they've bargained eight times with no resolve. The negotiations come after a challenging year for health care workers. They have been going to work under circumstances that they were completely not prepared for um, and the employer uh, was not prepared for either. The contract affects 4,000 Alina healthcare workers in Minnesota, like nurses, surgical techs, and health unit coordinators. The workers say Alina is refusing to offer a pay increase for the first year of the deal and also say management refuses to address issues regarding workplace safety and staffing. Healthcare workers picketed Wednesday outside Alina's Abbott Northwestern Hospital. One of eight locations where the impacted employees work. It is disrespectful. This should be the easiest contract we've ever had to negotiate after the year we just experienced. Alina Health told WCCO they pay SCIU employees five to six percent more money on average compared to other health systems, and that they lost $32 million last year. A statement said in part Alina Health respects and values the important contributions of all our employees. We continue to be committed to a settlement that is fair to our employees, patients, and our communities. They call us heroes. But they refuse to treat us like that. Kate Raditz, WCCO 4 News. The bargaining team would have to give a 10 day notice for any potential strike. The two sides are expected to talk again on Friday.